Hello to all. Today we are going to differentiate between the two categories of the plants. One are known as the monocarpic plants and another are known as the polycarpic plants. Now what is monocarpic and what is poly? Mono means one. Poly means many. So they are called as monocarpic. Why? Because monocarpic plants flower only once in their lifetime. What are monocarpic plants? Monocarpic plants are the plants which flower only once in their lifespan and that's why they are called as monocarpic. Now polycarpic plants are the plants which flower every year in a particular season. Every year but in a particular season. Okay. So poly means many. So polycarpic plants flower every year in a particular season season fine so are you able to differentiate between the monocarpic and the polycarpic plants now coming to the second one these plants are generally annual or biennial if you have heard about there are three types of the plants annual biennial and perennial annual plants are the plants which complete their life cycle only in one season okay biennial plants are the plants which complete their life cycle in Two years okay uh, that is there is one season and the another season okay and perennial plants complete their life cycle or we can say it as they live for many years more than two years okay so generally it has been seen that monocarpic plants are annual or biennial again I am repeating monocarpic plants are generally annual or biennial but exceptionally, not generally, exceptionally, there are few perennial plants which are also monocarpic. Generally, perennial plants are polycarpic, but there are few perennial plants which are monocarpic, means they will flower only once in their lifetime. Say for the two examples are Bambusa tulda, Bambusa tulda and Strobilanthus kunthiana. Again, I am repeating Bambusa tulda and Strobilanthus kunthiana are the two perennial plants which flower only once in their lifespan. Fine. Now, polycarpic plants are perennial. Polycarpic plants are perennial, right? But here also there is an exception that there are few perennial plants have flowers, right? Few perennial plants have flowers throughout the year. Just now I have said that polycarpic plants flower every year in a particular season, in a particular season. But if I talk about the China rose, the China rose is actually showing flowering throughout the year. It is a perennial plant, but it flowers throughout the year. But generally the polycarpic plants flower every year in a particular season. Fine. Now the third point is monocarpic plants die after flowering and fruiting. Now monocarpic plants flower only once and after doing the flowering they die. Okay. Monocarpic plants die after flowering and fruiting. But the polycarpic plants do not die after flowering and fruiting because they are successively every year they are successively producing the flowers and the fruits. So the polycarpic plants will not die after flowering and fruiting while the monocarpic plants will die after flowering and fruiting. Now there are few examples here of annual and biennial plants, right? And these are actually the monocarpic plants, say for the rice, wheat, radish, carrot, bamboo, right? All these are monocarpic plants. And polycarpic plants, examples are apple, mango, grapevine, orange. All these are very good examples of polycarpic plants, okay? So these were few differentiating features between the monocarpic plants and the polycarpic plants. So thanks a lot for watching me.